Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a skeleton um, for an object and then uh, attach the skeleton to that object. So I've got a simple object here. I have a um, simple cylinder that I've made. It's actually made up of several cylinders put together and then I merged those cylind cylinders together using the union tool. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the rigging menu set and to do this and I'm going to click on skeleton and create joints. I'll just click on the option box next to create joints and I've got here these settings uh, that I've um, I added before so short bone length and long bone um, length are the same and short bone radius and long bone radi radius are the same. Okay so with that op with this um, tool settings open I can um, go to shading and I can go to x-ray to see the actual inside of this object and I might just um, orbit so I'm in the top view just so I can make sure that the skeleton's going to go straight along this object and at the front of the object I'm just going to click to add the start of the skeleton and then I'm just going to keep clicking trying to keep it straight and actually, actually yeah, I can actually hold down shift to keep the skeleton straight as well. Just keep clicking, clicking, and then hit enter or return when I'm done. Okay, so that's the skeleton. It's actually sticking out of the object a little bit, but that doesn't matter. It won't be visible when it's rendered. Okay, so these little round bits here, the um, spheres, those are the joints, and then these um, triangular prisms um, are the, oops, they're the actual bones. So we've got joints and we've got bones. Okay. Now to actually attach this skeleton and you can click on different parts of the skeleton. So there's a hierarchy. This is the parent and these are the children, All right? So there's a hierarchy to this skeleton and you can join, um, you know, different skeletons together. You can make like a human body. But anyway, click at the start of this skeleton to select the whole skeleton in its hierarchy and hold down shift to select this shape as well. And we'll go to skin and then bind skin. All right, so now when you click on the shape, it selects everything, including its skeleton. Now, if you try to um, click, let's grab the select tool, click on different parts of the skeleton, like maybe here in the middle, you could grab the rotate tool and you can rotate it like that. Okay. All right, click up here, do the same thing down here, do the same thing, could move it as well. Okay, scale it. All right, so it's all attached together. The skeleton is going all the way along this object. Um, and note that when you go to the front of the skeleton and select that and rotate it, it will actually rotate everything. Okay, that's the parent of all these um, children here, all these other joints and bones. Okay, and if you move it, it will move the whole thing. Um, same with scaling or scale down the whole thing. So it depends on where you select it in the hierarchy. All right, so that's basically how to create a skeleton with bones and joints and how to um, bind it to a skin. Um, so how to attach it to an object. Thanks for watching.